These ladies have such incredible stories. Roma is Netflix's first movie to score a Best Picture nod, and its two leading ladies, Galitza Aparicio and Marina de Tavera, are vying for Best Actress and Best Supporting Actress at this year's awards. It's a first for both, but they're taking it all in stride. It's been a whirlwind award season for Yalitza Aparicio and Marina de Tavira, nominated for Best Actress and Best Supporting Actress for Roma at this year's Academy Awards. <laughs> the Netflix movie directed by Oscar winner Alfonso Cuaron is based on his own childhood in Mexico City and the women who helped raise him. Sitting down with the nominees, I asked how they're handling all the attention. People have been here amazing. They've received us with so much love. Betavira is best known for her stage work in Mexico. She auditioned knowing little about the role. They didn't say who the director was going to be. They, they just said, trust me, something beautiful, please come. And I said, okay, let's go. After multiple auditions, Betavira met Cuaron. What was he looking for? Because you play the role of his mother. So it's very personal. He talks a lot about how we, in life, don't try to show pain. We try to hide it constantly. That's what, how we work with Sofia. ¿A dónde vas? Sofia's journey in the movie is intertwined with Cleo, the housemaid to the family who walks a fine line between maternal figure, friend, and servant. Me va a correr. This is Aparicio's first acting role. She was an aspiring teacher when her sister encouraged her to audition. Your very first movie, and you're already an Oscar nominee. Es algo maravilloso porque... It's really very incredible. I wasn't expecting it. Aparicio's rise is noteworthy. From a small village in Oaxaca, Mexico, she is the first indigenous woman nominated for an Academy Award. She is also the first indigenous woman to be on the cover of Vogue Mexico and is featured on the cover of Vanity Fair's Hollywood issue. Did you ever dream in your life, someday I'm going to be in Hollywood on the red carpet? <laughs> no lo creía posible. I don't think so, or even if I ever did, I think the fact that I would look up onto the screens and I could never see people who looked like me on screen made me believe that it was not something that I could actually dream to, about or aspire to. While Cuaron's own nanny, Libo, served as inspiration, so did Yalita's own mother, also a housemaid. Part of the reason that you did this movie was to honor your mother. What did she think of the movie? Durante todo el rodaje, no During the shoot, I did not tell her what the film was about. I waited until she actually saw the film and she told me that it had been quite impactful. If the movie wins Best Picture of the Year, then what? I feel like we've already won. We're going to celebrate either way. <laughs> now, Roma has already taken home the Best Picture Award at the Critics' Choice, but Oscar night's still up for grabs.